KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is for Friday the 5th of July. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather not changing a whole lot. You know the deal. Hot, muggy, scattered storms. Could there be some tropical mischief maybe affecting the state in a week? Maybe, maybe not. We'll talk about that. Here we go. This is the upper look. Flat Ridge continues across the Gulf Coast region. Got a trough in the Pacific Northwest, a ridge in the Northeast. That's where the main westerlies are. Again this morning, we're in the 70s to start today. We're expecting highs in the low and mid-90s in most locations. There's the watch warning map. Pretty quiet. Flash flood watches for parts of the Virginias and Pennsylvania. Severe weather possibilities for today. Chance of strong storms out across the nation's heartland. Around here, we'll see scattered storms, but like recent days, organized severe storms not expected. Tomorrow, a couple of marginal risks well northwest and northeast of here. And on day three, which is Sunday, risk of severe storms over Montana and parts of Idaho. Here's the precipitation for the next seven days. If this verifies, the uh, bigger total should be south and east of here. But again, your number with this, as you know, will vary. Tropical weather, the Atlantic Basin for now stays very quiet. Over in the eastern Pacific, Barbara barely a hurricane in the uh, eastern Pacific. This will weaken to a tropical storm today and is expected to dissipate Sunday night well to the east of the Hawaiian Islands. So model fans, let's go here. This is the GFS, the 06C run, valid at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Got a ridge down here, moist, unstable air. The daytime heating process will lead to random scattered showers and storms, most of them between 1 and 9 p.m. And the high should be in the low 90s, maybe mid-90s in spots. Same thing for the weekend. This is tomorrow and Sunday. A mix of sun and clouds with scattered mostly afternoon and evening storms. Highs for the weekend around 90. Monday of next week, probably not much change. And there's maybe some evidence the mid-levels could be a little drier by midweek. Here's Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Now, Thursday, this run, the 06Z run, showing moisture surging back in here with deeper moisture coming in from the Gulf. But we all know it's really hard trying to identify the variations in placement and coverage of the afternoon storms days in advance. Well, let's go to Friday, and this is what has everybody's interest. This is a week from today, Friday, July 12th. Yeah, you see that uh, little mischief in the Gulf. GFS has a surface low that's off the Louisiana coast with very deep tropical moisture coming in here. And, of course, if this were to verify, we would have a much better chance of some rain toward the end of next week and maybe widespread rain if we have a little tropical wave or a depression, maybe a storm down there. And this is the European output, deterministic output, Friday evening of next week, and it's got the same idea, a tropical type low near Pensacola. And uh, again, we stress this is not a forecast. This is nothing but an idea that's on the table for now. There's no skill in a specific forecast out here. There is some skill at pattern recognition, and it's just a signal from the models and something we'll keep an eye on. Might vanish in coming days, might stay persistent. Let's go out 10 days. This is Sunday the 14th. That little feature from the Gulf is over southeastern Texas. And again, that would be fairly typical summer weather if this verifies. Precipitation coming off the uh, GFS Ensemble. The mean about one and a half inches here for the next 15 days and highs most days. Low and mid-90s and lows mostly in the low and mid-70s. That's it for the Weather Extreme video today. We'll have notes in the blog. Just one video today. We're on the holiday schedule. Back to two a days next week. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.